Hello, my name is Dr. Rudy Rosen, and I'm your instructor for Texas Aquatic Science, an introduction. I'm a research professor at the Meadows Center for Water and the Environment at Texas State University. I recently wrote the textbook, Texas Aquatic Science, in cooperation with Texas Parks and Wildlife Department, and the Heart Research Institute for Gulf of Mexico Studies at Texas A&M University at Corpus Christi. Texas Aquatic Science was modeled after the Missouri Department of Conservation's curriculum, conserving Missouri's aquatic ecosystems from which some of the text and illustrations were drawn and used or adapted. Funding for our work was provided by the U.S. Fish and Wildlife Service's Sport Fish Restoration Program and the Ewing Also Foundation, San Antonio. This lesson is adapted from that book published by and available from the Texas A&M University Press. Production of this lesson and video in part was funded by a grant from the National Science Foundation through the Research Coordination Network for Climate, Energy, Environment, and Engagement in Semi-Arid Regions. Today's lesson is on watersheds. To help focus today's lesson, here are a few questions to consider. What is a watershed? Which watershed do you live in? When it rains at your home, what creek and river does the water travel to? How does the watershed affect the water body into which that drains? How do human activities affect the quality and quantity of water in a watershed? What is point source pollution? What is non-point source pollution? And what are examples of each? What is erosion? What causes erosion? What is sediment? And where does sediment come from? How does human activity affect erosion and sedimentation? What is the impact of erosion and sedimentation on aquatic resources? What are Texas's natural regions? Is the water in your region drinkable, swimmable, and fishable? And for added thought, how does your location within a watershed affect the quality of water where you live? And how can you influence the quality of water for others in your watershed? 